Hello. Am I loading yet? There we go. Welcome back. It's Persona 5 time. Let's get the bear to watch TV. Emotes in the chat. And we're to go straight to bed, aren't we? Can I? No. Nope. <laughs> Literally just no. How is everyone doing though? It was worried if all the music, the sound had stopped working. On your feet, inmate. Our master has an important matter to discuss with you. Heed his words well. First, I'd like to congratulate you for expelling the one proud of their greed. Or so I'd like to say, but something odd seems to have happened. You tell me what happened, Igor. However, don't you sense it? The malicious will of another. It seems a contingency has occurred. At this rate, your rehabilitation cannot be completed. Though I doubt that will be the case. I truly look forward to seeing how you overcome this predicament. All right. Level nine already. Damn. We shall meet again. Time's up, inmate. Hurry yes, up and sir. return to your world. Only a low hit, not too bad. Is that true? Listen this time, okay? Why would no oh, harder? Oh. Oh, but what if I want to social link stuff? anything useful as evidence I see we're hoping to find something more than the calling card too we've confirmed the victim's connection to the phantom thieves at least thank you for your cooperation speaking huh they found a calling card in the principal's office too Suck it, Goro. <laughs> Your father hadn't said anything about the Phantom Thieves, correct? That's right. Please contact me if something catches your attention. It doesn't matter how trivial it seems. You don't have to force yourself, though. Just anything that comes to mind. The principal? No one told me about that. So basically, your group didn't go after Okumura's life. And even the death of Shujin's principal, who we found a calling card for, was the work of another. <sighs> you don't sound like you're lying. If you wanted to deceive me, you could have easily woven up a much simpler lie than this metaverse. 
Moreover, your account coincides with my own investigation. Is that even possible if it were made up? And I hate to admit, but with my line of work, I know a false testimony when I hear one. Still, if you set your sights on Okumura based on my intel, it'd be before his name was even ranked. You could have ignored him and targeted some other famous person. Why would you go so far as to further investigate and pursue this criminal? <laughs> Simple enough. There's still no proof that another suspect exists. That said, it's safe enough to say that you aren't the murdering type. No, no it isn't. Alright. But with the subsequent deaths of Okumura and Shujin's principal, the public's opinion changed. Pressed to prove your innocence, your next objective was... Hmm? What's the matter? <gasps> Is it a side effect? What in the world did the police inject into you? Can you hear me? hear me? You need to stay focused. <sighs> Don't scare me like that. If what you're saying is true, you Sorry, must tell I'm your high as a kite right now. End. We'll both be in trouble if your testimony becomes unreliable. <sighs> well then, let's move on. At last we arrive at your most recent crime. You know what I mean, don't you? This calling card was delivered to your latest target. The one you had decided would prove your innocence. It was addressed to Sai Nijima. Myself. Now, explain everything to me. I have done nothing wrong ever in my life. Clips my hand from my leg. <laughs> I'm not allowed to do it, am I? Yeah. Oh, you want to do it? Hold on, I want to check downstairs first. Nothing on TV. All right, let's go. If we have any protein, oh, we've got 13. Okay, now let's carry out our plan. Okay, <laughs> nice going. All right, all right. I wonder if you can like min max your HP. <laughs> like how much would you end up with? Let's meet up with everyone after school. Oh, why is it already about her? Like, how does dad just died?
With this, preparations are finally in place. The public has praised them as allies of justice before they strike them back to the ground. Now then, she'll be next. Yes, I've already spoken to Human Resources about it. It will be a heavy responsibility, but I'm certain it'd be an honor for her. The culprits behind the mental shutdown cases she's been pursuing all this time. <laughs> Indeed, they'll become the criminals we've set them up to be, just as you instructed. She's the one that called us, so she'll show up eventually. Well, even though things have calmed down, she must be occupied with what happened to her father. Wait, what? But what's up? People are posting that we killed President Okumura. So it's begun already. What? Think about it. The CEO collapsed the way he did during an apology conference that our group caused. Still! They were raving about us so much, and now they just treat us like murderers? What a lightning fast change of attitude. They don't know a damn thing about our situation. Calm down. Not everyone is necessarily saying that. But there's no way to vindicate ourselves. <clears throat> I'm sorry I'm late. I'm the one who asked you all to make time for me, too. My condolences. Must be rough. I'm okay now. Girl, your dad just um, died. I called everyone together because there was something worrying me. Did you all target the principal? We're just skipping. You're just skipping over what? your dad died? Principal? You mean ours? Yes. What makes you say that? Yesterday, a public prosecutor came to my home. Um, it was a woman named Mijima-san. That's... I overheard her saying a calling card was found in the principal's office. Considering that this was right after what happened, it's got to be Shujin's. It's the first I've heard of it! Doesn't this all seem weird to you? It may just be my imagination, but I feel as if... Things are escalating far too quickly after President Okumura's incident. What do you mean? Perhaps... We may have been set up by the real culprit. For real? That could be. Then we need to catch them as soon as possible. Hold a moment. Can we assume we've been set up, though? We don't even know their objective. What else are we supposed to do, then? Let's... All calm down for a moment. From what Haru said, even the police are suspecting that the Phantom Thieves are murderers. It wouldn't be wise to carelessly make a move at the moment. We need to act as normal students for now. In addition, we have midterms next week. Exams? Oh boy, exams. Like this? <sighs> I envy you, Futaba. Futaba? Hmm? Got something on my mind. Gonna go home and look into it. I wonder what that could be. At any rate, we need to behave and not draw attention to ourselves. Understood? I mean, they literally sell these calling cards at stores, so like it wouldn't be hard. Please stop having a parasocial relationship with me.
even though we know each other. Mishima is a bit narrow-sighted, but he's a good person deep down. We can't betray him. Wait. That's like an honest student. Get ready for midterms. Follow the situation. We don't need to study. We can't just need kindness. Can I check my... What would it be under? Social stats. Uh, just guts and kindness. Let's see if we can find... Feather and Seeker. Okay. Well then. Oh. So up, down, up, down. Tri free triangle, free circle. Am I just doing this for the Featherman story? Yes. I hope someone has put together all the Featherman plots. Pardon. Well, guess I'm not finding what Mona said. Impossible.
Why is everything about Kasumi? Haru's dad just died. How is that not the talk of this school? Like, oh, don't you know? She goes to our school. Mercenary who works as an assassin's eye milk in Shibuya Underground. <laughs> oh, Yohi Kiritan. So gotta go to therapy. <laughs> Game season. Oh. Maybe therapy? Yes, therapy. Do you like the rain? Hmm. It's open. Let's find out do we have anything. Murky for the five gifts. Let's try giving him that. See what he thinks. Be careful, okay? I'm going to get, I'm going to get an A in therapy. <laughs> Big Bamberger aren't suffering under the death of their present. What would you like? One Minberger. To the challenge. Yeah. We do need to go and uh, uh Mementos just for money. Thank you very much. Hmm. We did it. All right. Wait, so wanna head back? Oh well, maybe we had enough to question the bag. Maybe we had enough to know about our weed. However, that means we only have to raise kindness now.
This sucks. Hey, are you listening? No way. <laughs> hey. No, it didn't. My charm is maxed. I am so charming. And also a horrible person. Son needs me. Okay, hold on. I need to see if therapy is an option. Um, it is. Therapy is more time sensitive. Thank you. Nice. All right. All right. Nice. Well, see you.
We need to see if there's other things we can do. I don't think. I get the feeling. Hold up. Maybe we won't spend time together. No. No other socials around here, huh? Me as well. We're very fast with that funeral. That's not really time for an autopsy. Horror, she's the one who should be in pain right now. Yet she's still trying to cheer us up. Well then. Okay, so. That will be our sister. Well, we can spend time with her, if she's willing. Game, can I talk to her? Please? Can I talk to her? Yo. Oh yeah, I'm too mean a person. Oh, that might be a Ryuji.
I didn't mean to pick that. Refuse that time for mementos. She seems down. You should keep her in your thoughts. Still, despite how she looks, Haru has quite the backbone. I'm sure she'll be okay. Okay, so maybe Ryuji. <laughs> oh, wait, no, we need to go speak to. <laughs> You're a strange one, kid. Wait a sec. <laughs> yeah, this could work. Hey, I can grant that wish of yours, but you better have the money. These things are worth hundreds of thousands of yen per unit. Sometimes they even reach the millions, depending on how I feel. That right. Look, I ain't a bad dude. I've been known to compromise from time to time. For example, you help me out with my business, smuggling goods, destroying evidence, and as a reward, I'll introduce you to the special menu with good prices for a punk like you. What do you say? Not bad, huh? on a need-to-know basis and you don't need to know gotta fight evil with evil I need a pawn of my own don't talk to no one about this got it just follow my orders yes sir now what's it gonna be you gonna take my deal or not that's fine okay I'll work on that special menu for you you should be grateful you had model guns in your possession as well. Their detail goes beyond a simple hobby. I'm sure some people believed those guns were real. You'll tell me how you procured them, won't you? Spill it! I am thou. Thou art I. Thou hast acquired a new vow. It shall become the wings of rebellion that breaketh thy chains of captivity. With the birth of the hanged man. Thanks. All right. 
Oh yeah, when I don't got any business going on, I'll have you do some clean, run errands. There's plenty for you to do around here. Must be pretty exciting for an enthusiast like you, huh? Hey. We finally did it chat, we finally got a part time job in this game. Phantom Thieves have gone off the deep end, don't you think? I thought they were gonna change that CEO's heart, but they ended up killing him instead. Haven't people been saying they killed Principal Kobayakawa too? I thought they were bad, but I never expected they'd turn out to be murderers. Oh man, does this mean anyone who gets targeted is screwed? Quiet down. I'll now be handing out your exam booklets. Well, shall we begin? Ooh, we can do this! You're still rooting for the Phantom Thieves? You know they're murderers, right? That doesn't mean that criminals should be left to do whatever they want. Still, couldn't they have at least left the principal to the police? And I mean, did you see that press conference? No way Allies of Justice would do that. I wonder if Akechi-kun has been right all along. He's so admirable sticking to his guns even though so many people were against him. That's enough. If you don't quiet down, I'll have to ask you to leave. Now, everyone. Ooh, we can do this! Ooh, we can do this! Phantom Thieves have got to be students here, right? I mean, they killed our principal. Isn't this insane? There are murderers among us. Now that you mention it, there was a guy in Shibuya who told me he's a Phantom Thief the other day. For real? You gotta report that. Oh crap. You think so? I snapped a pic, so I should probably put it online just in case. I hope the cops catch him. Okay, class, let's get started. Ooh, we can do this! I get freaked Ooh, out having to see right-handed people. <laughs> Things I cannot process. Ha <laughs> ha! 
<laughs> the police are here again? Yeah, seems like it's for real this time. Apparently one of our students is a phantom thief. Seriously? I read the same thing online. Apparently public security is already on the move. Let's see. Please. I need time. It's open. Um. Welcome. Those plans. Oh, I know. You should go help Haru. Wait, what? No, oh, I have social links to do. Oh, have you come up here to assist me? You, um, heard that, didn't you? I'm not worried about the garden, in case you were wondering. It's just, so much has happened to me lately. I could share this with you. I mean, it would be nice to have someone who is aware of my current situation in life. The source of my worries is my father's company. Dealing with the aftermath has been difficult. Given how unexpected the accident was, my father didn't have a will. All of his stocks transferred to me. Which means suddenly, I'm the biggest shareholder in a company of over 1,000 employees. Yeah, I can't but help with that. I don't know the first thing about I don't business either. direction or fund management. <sighs> yes, it is quite hard to fathom. I may be the president's daughter, but I never anticipated I'd end up involved in company matters. Because of that, lately I've been meeting with all the various officers and lawyers my father employed. They've been giving me advice on all the things I'm not entirely sure about. Assets? Stocks? It's clear some people only want to get on my good side, though. I don't know who I can trust. They try to sound comforting by saying things like, Don't worry, or leave it to me. But... It feels like they're really only being nice so they can get their hands on my bank account. I... I never realized I could be this distrustful of other people. Uh, I'm sorry for ranting on about this matter. I feel as though doing so has helped me calm down a bit, though. 
The only people I've consulted up to this point have I been guess employees. That's okay so to but do. I think what I really needed was someone closer to my own age, closer to my own viewpoint. Hmm. Um, if it isn't too much trouble, could we speak about this again some other time? In return, I'll. Hmm. What can I do to help you? I don't have any unique talents. How about this? You know, gardening. I'm actually quite skilled at it. A few years ago, I even managed to grow a tropical fruit on the balcony at my house. To be honest, this is what I do when I'm alone. To take my mind off of everything that's happened. <sighs> oh, that's right. I stored some vegetables in the refrigerator down in the home economics room. You still have some time, yes? Would you mind waiting here a moment? I grew these right here in these very planters and harvested them myself not too long ago. There's not much consistency to their colors or shapes, but... <laughs> you like vegetables? That's good to know. But to tell the truth, I have a favor to ask of you. I'd like to get Sakura-san's opinion on my vegetables. Do you think I could bring my next harvest over to your cafe? Thank you. I'm sure Sakura-san will give me his honest opinion. I'll make sure this next harvest is particularly good. Well then, shall we head over to the hideout? Congrats on surviving midterms. Thank you. Uh, I think I'm screwed for real this time. I couldn't concentrate at all. Gathering everyone's opinions and immediately acting upon them. In order to make that natural course of action a reality. Uh, again? It's so damn loud! More importantly, what's this you want to talk about? You said that something was on your mind before. But were you able to figure out what it was? The medjet that I banned wasn't the real one. Huh? Aren't you the real one, though? Oh, uh... The guy who called himself Medjet after me isn't the one from the other day. What do you mean? The code written by that guy the other day is different from any of the past Medjet. And that means... A code is like your fingerprints. No matter how you try to disguise it, your own quirks appear in it. The one from the other day was all cut and pasted with no consistency. No skill at all. But aren't there multiple people across the world that are part of Medjet? Couldn't it have been done by someone that joined recently? How do I put it? That code was so not done by anyone interested in cracking. At all. At the very least, there's no way it was an official Medjet member. So someone used the Mejed name to provoke the Phantom Thieves? For what purpose? Could they have been doing it for fun? It was around the time our group started getting popular, so maybe they wanted in on the hype. Wait a moment. What if it's the other way around? Hmm? Perhaps they used the Mejed name to make the Phantom Thieves known. What? That makes no sense! I actually thought the same as Makoto. Why is that? Know how I just said that code is like fingerprints? I found those same fingerprints somewhere completely different. Where's that? The Phantom Aficionado website. There were traces of it being hmm? illegally tampered with from the outside. For real? For summer vacation, the access counter was made to be much higher than the actual number. Same with the rankings. Particularly the time when President Okumura ranked first. So then, the one who provoked the group, and the one who tampered with the site, are the same person? I think I'm starting to see the big picture. Both Medjed's provocation and the tampering of the website brought attention to us as a result. On top of that, our reason for targeting Okumura was influenced by the public and the rankings. The perfect timing, and the perfect target. If both of those had been set up... It would all make sense. So the culprit was planning to put the blame on us from the start? 
No way. This is all hypothetical. We lack any hard evidence. But if all your deductions happen to be correct, that would mean we've been playing right into their hand for the past two months or so. We gotta be overthinking things. I mean, we're talking both the rankings and Medjed. Everyone made a big deal about it. If this was all set up, then what kind of guy did we make an enemy of? What? Uh -oh. There's no point in getting anxious over speculation. Regardless, we'll be falsely charged at this rate and with murder. We must overcome this. But we don't even know who we're up against. Hey, you think we're falling into another trap? Even at this very moment? Yeah. This doesn't mean that we've lost yet. Even if this is the actions of a meticulous enemy, we'll just have to get back at them. We need to find clues, no matter what. Me? I was told you recommended this reassignment yourself, sir. Why would you choose someone as inexperienced as myself? Cracks on my toes. When the case of the Shujin Principle was ruled a suicide, you thought to reopen it. And you proved its connection to the Phantom Thieves. This is based primarily on that achievement. I'm honored, sir. The Phantom Thieves issue is now a national crisis. Expectations are exceedingly high for us public prosecutors, as we are the executors of justice. Personnel and planning will be up to you on this case. You will also have the police under your command. I'd like you to oversee this operation. <sighs> You've yet to give an answer. Will you accept the task of eradicating the Phantom Thieves? I will give it everything I have. We'll have to prepare a higher position for you as well in the event that you succeed. I don't wish to apply extra pressure on you, but I assume your odds of success are high. <laughs> Naturally, failure to accomplish this task is unacceptable. Do you understand? Of course. I will live up to your expectations no matter what it takes. That is all, then. I expect good results from you. I'm home. Hi, sis. Should I warm up dinner for you? No, it's okay. How about a bath? No need. I just came home to get a change of clothes. Are you going to stay at work, then? I've been entrusted with a very important task. You look awful, though. Aren't you tired? <laughs> As an adult, there will be times when you will accept an assignment for which failure is not tolerated. It's all over for me if I can't win this. Still, if you were to collapse from exhaustion... This is my one chance to get a promotion. Do your earrings match her hair? I heard detectives have been coming to your school. Girl? That must make it hard to focus on your studies. Don't Why worry, would you do that? It will all be over soon. It's disgusting. What do you mean? I'm going to catch the Phantom Thieves myself. Is that the important task you missed? I know you want something professional, but go for cold. It's none of your concern. Oh. Oh my god. Sis has her sights set on the Phantom Thieves, and on Shujin Academy in particular. This is bad. I need to let everyone know. Isn't that every prosecutor in Japan? <laughs> uh, 
Everything's going to be fine. Unless they know about the metaverse, there's no way they'll get any info on us. Oh, hello, Obaki. How are you? I'm sorry, but I'm actually about to go and BRB. I won't be long, though. Thank you for your patience. Yeah, I'm... <laughs> I hope you're doing better, Sunobaki. But I'm doing alright. Uh, oh, I can't go outside, huh? That's sad day. Oh, you want to do it? You triggered the night bot. <laughs> oh. yes. And I rotated enough to hit the mic. Yeah, we have 13 protein, we can have some of those. Or 12 now, 11 now even. Now, let's carry out our plan. All right. All right. Well then. Yeah. That's the attitude. there today too, right? Yeah, what do those damn cops think they are? They can't just stare us all down like that. Maybe the rumors are true. Maybe there's a phantom thief at our school. Okay, quiet down.
I've never said anything unnecessary in my life. Well then, next up is Takamaki-san and you two will go together. Huh? Why together? Why? They'll probably have one of you wait outside. That's how they've been doing it so far. Uh, oh yeah, right. Those are the instructions the detectives gave us. Just don't say more than is necessary and try and get it over with quick. Take a seat. We're sorry to take your time. This will be over quick. Let's see. Ah, yes. You're the one currently under probation. It says here you had a dispute I'm a with criminal. Mr. Kamishida. Thank you, detective. You're more hot-blooded than you look. Thank Spend you. time with quite an interesting group. Yusuke Kitagawa and Haru Okumura? Yusuke doesn't go to our school. The more friends, the better, right? I'm sorry to have taken your time. You're free to go now. Oh, I almost forgot. There's just one more thing I have to ask you. Do you think the Phantom Thieves are associated with this school? We won't know for certain unless we investigate further. Thank you for your time. <laughs> that didn't feel like... Serve as great reference material. Takamaki-san is next. Could you ask her to come in? I got so nervous, I almost stuttered a few times. I thought I was used to police questioning by now, too. I guess yours was a lot more vigorous than ours. It seems we were all asked the same questions. That's how they get you. They do that on purpose, then wait for someone to slip up. Okay, but why would Makoto have any problem with Kamoshida? I hope you didn't. It was probably fine. <laughs> I would have been done for if they saw how sweaty my hands were, though. To think my name would come up as well. Sounds like we can't take the police lightly, either. Hey, didn't you think that detective guy was scary? Not to me. He looked like someone who's dealt with dangerous criminals. Ain't that old? Mm. Sorry for Ain't that what you should expect of a detective? Of my sister. That's not true, Mako-chan. It's not as though I hadn't predicted this would happen. But now that it's become reality, I'm unsure of what to do. We need to make sure we don't draw suspicion and work to clear our names. Right? Right. It ain't your fault, Makoto. I'm gonna try to see how far along this investigation really is. I'm worried about the police, too, but as of now, anyone in this city could be a mole. They were so popular, too. Haru, can I ask you to search your father's belongings for clues about a possible culprit? I thought Futaba said they, and she was just talking about moles in general. <laughs> like, she just really likes moles. I... I know it may be tough on you. No, it's okay. Now isn't the time for me to look away. As for everyone else, you need to be cautious of how you spend your time at school. So, I've decided to have you three second years join me on the school festival. No, no, I have therapy. Why? It will allow us to gather without drawing suspicion. Plus, trying to blend in will only do the opposite. Ah, uh, fine. I agree. The more time I have to kill, the more time I'll spend worrying about all this stuff. No matter what happens, I don't want to regret my decisions. Don't jinx it! It would be no surprise if they came directly to our homes for questioning. They showed up at your school after all. I should remain cautious. For now, the best option is to stay on the defensive. But we won't make progress at this rate. Let's try and figure out who the real culprit is somehow, okay? Of course. <laughs> yeah, I'm still not allowed it. Oh, you want to do it? Yes. 
We're just using all our protein now to get this HP up. All right. Nice. All right. Well then. <coughs> I have another suggestion. Call for the arrest of the Phantom Thieves, then mobilize the police. The rest will go as you mentioned. <laughs> Still, I'm truly no, I'm totally the mole. At the atrocious method. How do you think I'm paying off my probation? I'm getting people involved in crime, then reporting them so I look good and I get off probation. See, big brain please. Total count of each column. Uh, seven, six, six, <laughs> fourteen. And that also makes thirteen. And that makes twelve. Oh no. Uh, so I can do it to fourteen. I also have 8 and 6 to work with, okay, so that would be 14. So I could put. I could put 1 there. Then, if that makes 13, that'd be 2 there, because those both make 13. And that one would be. 3. Yeah, and then 3, 7. And four. There you go. <laughs> We're not doing maths. We're not doing maths anymore. <laughs> this is it. Correct. Oh, five even. That's where I was getting confused. <laughs> no. Do you think we can get Goro to be the guest of Obana? I'm surprised the police aren't more suspicious of her, given she's not like riled up about her father's death. Damn it! We don't have time to be doing crap like this. 
You don't need to keep mentioning it. We're doing this to keep suspicions off of us, remember? Goro Akechi. Hell yeah. Yes. This one too. Yes. Akechi. Yes. Yes. They're mostly the same over here as well. Yes. Yes, I win. So eloquent when they can be anonymous. It's like they never accepted us to begin with. Let's get him here. Nice did some work too, Ryuji -kun. Yo, can we dance can at this? Count these, right? Come on, leader. Can, can you be my date? Count your votes for Goro Akechi. You know, like online and stuff. I guess that's one way of saying it. Whoa, look here. This ain't good. Criminal stop checking. Profiling? Stop checking Twitter. The acts of thievery committed by the Phantom Thieves are mere fakes. And their true goal is murder? Every heart they changed before Okumura was just a warm up? Uh, so now they're accusing us of being a bunch of killers. God, this is so effing stupid. Damn it. We have the results. First place is yes! Akechi. Yes! <laughs> what? Akechi? Get some hype in the chat. What are you so surprised for? We've been mentioning him this whole time. Seriously? Not some singer or an idol? It's because of us that his popularity has skyrocketed. We're the ones counting the results. Can't we just make him up? We don't have to get him. People will figure that out. He won by a landslide. I knew people would vote for him, but this is way more votes than I was expecting. It would be best for us to avoid inviting such a clear danger upon ourselves. I'd like a little more time to think about who to ask. That reminds me. How was Futaba-chan doing? She seemed like she was looking into something on her own. Has she told you anything? It's not that I don't trust her, but... Even one clue would work wonders for us. We should let her continue with her own investigation. I hope she finds something. Hey. In response to the police identifying the Phantom Thieves as primary suspects, Goro Akechi had this to say. Even though my opinion has been met with criticism, I've held fast that the Phantom Thieves are not just. You're such However, a little bitch. <laughs> I believe the recent series of suspicious deaths is unrelated to their actions. B what? Did I hear you correctly? That mob boy. You were the first to caution everyone about the Phantom Thieves. Were you not? This doesn't change the fact that they are indeed a dangerous group. That said, I would like to express that immediately linking them to this case is far too hasty. There are still many questions to be answered here. It feels as though there is more to this. After this conference, Akechi-san announced he will be limiting his media appearances and... I wonder why the sudden change. Hmm. Staring at your phone like that for? Oh, are you going through a breakup? <laughs> You're trying to show off. Don't get cocky, kid. By the way, you haven't been causing any trouble, have you? Always am. I heard the police showed up at your school. Not everything that happens about me. Let them come. <laughs> can't let you get away with that, you know. No. You're sure you're not getting involved in anything? <sighs> well, fine. Oh. Hold on, I need to see if there's any other ones I can need to do. Goro hasn't been talking to us. Hobby. 
Well, we can go see him anyway. Spend our money on a ticket. To be told no. Do you love me yet? Hi. Mine. I guess I'll go to my new job. Goro, please. That was a welcome peanut. How are you doing, little peanut? Hope you're all right. All right. Later. Great proficiency bonus, guys. That's exactly what we need. Just what we need. This game really wasn't suited for you, min maxing on baseball. Mood, it's getting hot here. Once the wind dies down, we're in trouble. Has Nijima-san told you anything about the investigation? Well, Sis actually stopped mentioning anything about work in front of me. It's possible I made some sort of mistake. Regardless, I thought over the matter of who we're going to invite for our school festival. Goro. I'm considering Goro. asking a Yes, Kisigun. yes, it's going to be a date. Yes. For real? Weren't you talking about how you didn't want to draw danger to us or whatever? Yes, date. I understand this danger, is dangerous, date. But without a powerful school. source of intel, we won't be able to win against the police network. And I can no longer rely we're gonna on my sister for We're going to antagonize each other across the Wait, room. Is this because of Akechi-kun's police connections? You're going to use him as your powerful source of intel? Bold move. I'm surprised to hear that suggestion coming from you, Makoto. Did you see his press conference yesterday? <laughs> we all love Goro. We all love Goro. Stood out to me. There is more to this. I think he said that knowing for certain that the Phantom Thieves would be watching. Still, there will be so many other students at the school festival. What are the odds of success? It's a gamble. True, and the he odds is your are twin. Less than favorable, but we can no longer afford to hesitate. What are your thoughts? Yes! I'm going to kiss him. Okay then. Is everyone else okay with that? I'm good. In front of the entire school. This has got to be more reliable than what I've been able to come up with. 
It would be reassuring to gain him as an ally, rather than simply a source of information. Hold on, how are we even gonna get in touch with him? It's not like we got his contact info. Yeah, uh, yeah. <laughs> I got his number. For real? We were flirting. <laughs> Could you send that my way, please? No, I'll, I'll talk to him. I'll contact him right away. There will be no kissing booth. Say, there will be no privacy. On this a catchy deal. It will be right in front, in the middle of the hall, in front of everyone. No excuses. Now's no time to be petty. Just think of him as a source of intel, nothing more. He's my antithesis and no one else's. I have a response already. He How did you get number? About it. How did you get this number? Only, only Joker is allowed to speak to me on this number. Wait a sec. Didn't he say he wasn't gonna do any more stuff for the media? It's not the media. It's a high school. Oh, maid That's cafe. That's why he's so hesitant. Oral maid cafe. Mm -hmm. What well, are we gonna do if he turns us down? Yeah, it's called boyfriend time when I ask him, <laughs> not when Makoto asks him. I'll keep trying. Unless you sound it like he <laughs> Joker is asking, can you? Maybe frustrating, but he's all we have at the moment. Damn right he's we all need we have. Him to do it, no matter what. Oh I have. Don't know what you guys have to do with it. <laughs> We're counting on you, Makoto. I thought we'd end up prying on Oh, I'm allowed outside. Man, where are we going outside? Oh, nothing in there soft. I'm honestly, she might be the mate at this point because I don't think we have. Oh. Let's hang out with Sochiro. All right then. Wish we could go to Goro's house. Thanks. I left it on. <laughs> Kiss me. Are you over the whole treat me like your savior thing, please? Um, well. You're right, it's yes. not your place to ask. Slams into microphone <laughs> to make my feet see warmsies.
Nice going. Let's see how our grades are. <laughs> we did it, chat. Hey. We're top of the class. And we got an achievement for it. I am so smart. All the time, my brain is so smooth. No rank, please. Dabs on, yes. <laughs> Cool, it's my wife. <laughs> Hello. You're back awfully late. <laughs> In front of social. What's business been for you lately? <laughs> I guess you cannot, you cannot justify it like we didn't. <laughs> Why are you like this? Why'd you do this to me? Take a look around. Is the Nijima lady doing well? Unfortunately, we haven't seen each other lately. We had a difference of opinion. Anyone mind with a clip? <laughs> I'm going to need that later. Representative Shino. Oh, I can. Let's see if I remember this command correctly. Yep. It doesn't surprise me that people say our country is lethargic. We've let these phantom thieves run amok. And because they've targeted only prominent figures, our government leaders have been hesitant to act. I apologize for any concern they may have caused, and will henceforth search for an apt countermeasure. That politician's really honorable. I like how quick he says he's going to do everything. People trusting politicians? Y'all? Really? Y'all trust the politicians? This is an important undertaking, and one I intend to confront with every asset available to me. The selfish criminals enacting this social reform are in fact the ones most deserving of reformation. Answering to the interests of the people as I'm sorry, I'm not distracted by how Goro is sitting. Duty as a politician. Man, this guy is admirable. Rampant how are you sitting? Thieves on the loose. As sad as it is, this is the state of our nation. Well, they do on a we horse couldn't set that up nicely. And I assure the people of this noble country that I will do just that. I'm sure it's like just really long. Sorry, was something yeah, not good happening? <laughs> Standing here is my job. That politician is honest and carries an overwhelming amount of charisma. Lines never uttered by anyone ever. <laughs> it feels like a trustworthy leader for Japan has finally come forth. Don't you think, boss? Sorry, wasn't listening. Criminals, hmm? Well, that must be how he sees it. However, that is ignorant of their true nature. It isn't about liking or disliking them. 
It's more about how he suggests the Phantom Thieves be crushed when they've yet to be arrested. If this Okumura incident was not the Phantom Thieves, if they only change the hearts of criminals, then even though they can't be considered innocent, perhaps my goals are not so different from theirs. <laughs> I knew there was something special about you, ever since the first time we met. <laughs> I feel as though I could tell you anything during our conversations. Boy. Boy. <laughs> My controller is lucky to be in one piece at this point. Oh, that reminds me. I've been invited to a panel at Shujin Academy and... Ah, wait. I'm sure you know that already. Wanna make out during it or...? Considering it's such a good opportunity, I've decided to accept the offer. It's because of me? <laughs> it's about me, right? About me? Me? Yes? <laughs> Thank you for the coffee. It was delicious. Glad you liked it. I'm happy I could see you. <coughs> uh, I need some hold on. Hold on. <coughs> oh, mm, mm -hmm. I'll be going now. <laughs> wow. <laughs> <laughs> We're just flirting and you tell me would you tell me he's smarter than me? <laughs> Glad none of you are asking about that. I'd like to tell you about my boyfriend. Yeah, why can't we hang out more? Why are you always turning me down? Oh, the bathhouse is open for charm. Oh wait, no, I ha I match charm. It's the kindness I'm looking. No, he's, he, it's okay, we've got Goro. He can have... He can have the counsellor. He can have therapy if he wants it. Oh, We're just using up all our protein now. Festival seems to be a success. There's definitely a lot more people than last year. Well, yeah. This place got famous and all. Phantom Thieves, Kamoshida, Jumped. Kobayakawa. On top of that, we got Akechi as a guest. There may be police officers in plain clothes, too. Actually, they probably are here. They are undoubtedly here. Careful. After all, you're here. Discuss. Acting like normal students is going to be important. What do you normally do at a school festival? Made cafe. Look around at the exhibits and eat stuff? 
There's no set rules for this kind of thing. Walk around and hang out, like when we went to the beach. I think I can do it. I want me to go to so bad. You're so laid back. There's a possibility that your name and Ryuji's have come up. A number of the teachers had been questioned before, and even we were interviewed the other day too. Don't let your guard down too much. It's true that the initial members have been at this for a long time, making it easier to get tracked. All right. Now, now, let's leave it at that. We just need to be mindful about what we're saying, correct? Oh, um... <sighs> you seem to be having quite a lot of fun, Haru. You did mention that you were looking forward to this. I want to go around with everyone and eat at the refreshment stands. This will be a great change of pace from all the nasty stuff lately. Shall we head off to the stands then? Mm. All right. This is your first time at our school festival. They're pretty good, from what I've heard. I know a great one. Follow me. This is the place. Made takoyaki? New customers! I'll show you all to your seats. So, it's your classes stand. It's still a refreshment stand, isn't it? It's like a deserted island here. Well, I guess it's good for talking since there aren't any people here. I wish Goro were working here. I'm gonna eat takoyaki yeah, made by Goro in a meat costume. And it was all bullshit. Here she comes. Act normal. Who cares? There's nothing normal about this anymore. Welcome home. May I take your order? Take my order? W what happened to the maid atmosphere? There are a lot of odd flavors. Stick to a normal one. I bet they... I'm so sorry. We sold our last normal one to the previous customer. The hell... How did well, you run out of normal I'll ones? I'll have the mentai cheese takoyaki. I'm sorry, we're out of cod, bro. What do you then have? How about the squid? Um, we're currently out catching squid. It'll probably take another five or how six hours. How long is this festival? That doesn't even sound remotely possible. Ain't this whole menu just a sham? Actually, we spent most of our budget on making the maid costumes look nice. We didn't put too much effort into the octopus. Oh, I can see that. Ryuji, you're making a scene. I would too. <laughs> then, what would you recommend with what you have now? That would be the Russian takoyaki. We'll have that, please. This will take a little time. How long? Uh, let's forget about, about the octopus and it. get back on topic. On that note, hearing Kamoshida being almost treated like a victim makes me want to eat my stress away. I've even heard conjecture that the principal was targeted for reasons like he knew too much. I kept hearing about Goro Akechi's popularity. From me. All thanks to the Phantom. And my chat. You know, we all love did Goro. Did the guy agree to show up here because he believes we didn't kill anybody? Or he may simply love large gatherings. Or he may yeah, simply true. love me. He didn't seem like he minded being pampered by the media at all. We plan on stealing intel, but we might fall into another trap. I'm gonna be bummed if that happens. You are so carefree. Does it mean that you have nerves of steel in any situation? Sure do. Still, it doesn't change the fact that we don't know what Akechi-kun is planning. Thank you for the wait! Ooh, it's fresh made! Lies! I heard a microwave go off. You can well, microwave it's not takoyaki. Like I was expecting crispy takoyaki at a school festival or anything. So, what makes this a Russian takoyaki? Could there be jam in it as a secret ingredient? That sounds quite delicious. Well, yeah, exactly. One special. Oh. <laughs> uh, one of them's obviously red. That's got to be the one. Dude. Don't tell me the Russian part means... It's like, going for the obvious one is manly. I is that so? 
Well, I'd prefer the most beautifully shaped one. But all of them are misshapen. <laughs> oh, aren't you all going to eat? I think I'll go for the special one. Wait, is she honestly going for it? Do you want to go for the red one? No, I want to let Haru have it. Oh, you sure? All right, then I'll just help myself to it. Not. Haru wants oh, it. Let her. Ha everyone's all here. <laughs> pass me that red ticket. Yeah, pass me that red ticket. Yeah, pass me that red ticket. Yeah. <laughs> the the panel isn't until tomorrow, though. I came to check out the venue. I can't make any mistakes since a lot of people will be present. Pass me that red ticket. Yeah, okay. <laughs> But people ended up recognizing me. Everyone bombarded me with questions. Want me to flop up your hair again? That's because you were sloppy. Don't be mean to him. The baseless rumors they kept bringing up. So I escaped to where there weren't any people. Wow. I'm going to have one of these. <laughs> <laughs> the special one. There, have it. Let's just call this my performance fee. <laughs> <laughs> it's fine. Hmm. It's quite the. <laughs> <laughs> Eating it in one bite is a bad idea. <gasps> My throat. Damn, guys. This... We have we have to do an emergency procedure on his mouth. It's it's integral. We have to. <laughs> oh, oh, my stomach. It burns. Are you okay? Do you need water? I'm, I'm fine. <laughs> Go I, I just love, uh, spicy, <laughs> spicy stuff. <laughs> I have to take him to the nurse's office real quick, hey, which is on the roof where no one is. To you? Well then, I'll, I'll see you uh, t -t tomorrow. <laughs> wow, he's really trying to hold it together. He's waddling around like some comedian. It's like he wants to get picked up for some commercial or something. But did he truly come to simply check the venue? This isn't good. I keep suspecting every little thing. I know what you mean. I'm doing the same thing. I need to do my best tomorrow. We need to somehow get him to be our source of intel. I'm going to pull this off no matter what. Yeah, he's just came to check and out his boyfriend. Guy. When he got here, didn't he say that everyone's all here? Everyone? The gang's all here. <laughs> You're here just imagining things. So, I guess we got through all of it okay? Oh, so he has seen us, like, together a lot, so... Yes, but the associated mental fatigue was extraordinary. Being cautious takes a lot out of you. Seriously, I think I'm as tired now as I am after midterms. I didn't mind any of that. I just love seeing that detective gulp down the special takoyaki. Futaba, don't be mean to him. I had fun as well, since I got to spend time with you all. What would you like to do now, Haru? Walk around a little more? I appreciate the gesture, but I'm satisfied with stopping here. Futaba, what about you? Why don't we go home and rest up? We'll have to deal with Akechi-kun again tomorrow after well, I'll all. deal with him. <laughs> I have to agree. What will his next move be? Oh? What else is new Morgana? Let's head back. Um. Oh, he had to go get therapy, right? Uh, yes. I. Quite. Indeed. <laughs> Hold on. 
how about it? You're going to get cancelled. <laughs> well then. <laughs> I see. Indeed. Thank you. Yes. I... Hmm. All right. Thank you. Them. Right, I'm going to bear be a second because I want to grab some food, so it might be a bit longer than usual, but I won't. I will be back.
Okay, I've now had a full bowl of Rice Krispies. <laughs> oh, check downstairs. I'm not allowed it. I'm not allowed outside. <laughs> Do it? Skip the protein this time. Yep, yes. gulp down cereal. Alright. Well then. Gotta come back from my goro. Most important things. Why are we up he here? This is suspicious. He says they Why aren't we in the crowd? Murders. Either he has an idea who the true culprit is, or he has uncovered the identities of the phantom thieves. Come on, Makoto. You gotta get it out of him. As much as you're allowed to say, would you tell us how far along your investigation is on them? Getting right to the point, I see. Well, if it's as much as I'm allowed to say, then everything on TV and the internet is all of it. We don't have any leads yet, and the methods behind their crimes are still unclear. I see. Even with this country's power, arresting them is proving to be difficult. Is that the case? I wouldn't phrase it that way, but, well, something like that. Thank you for answering that question. By the way, it seems you've denied a correlation between the Phantom Thieves and the murders. Why the sudden change? Until now, haven't you upheld your stance that the Phantom Thieves are dangerous? How are you so positive that they haven't? Makoto, you really are just interrogating him. Are you a little too comfortable interrogating people? Why, it's as if you're a prosecutor. <laughs> Koro! Chan's really pressing for an answer. She's pelting him with questions. Every person whose heart they changed have truly been criminals, including Okumura. Why then was he the only one who needed to be killed? Why is that? I must admit, I couldn't deduce a reason. That's why I believe that case should be thought of as if a different party is responsible. And if, this is all hypothetical, mind you, if the Phantom <laughs> Thieves are the ones I know of, I can't possibly imagine they would kill anyone. Your comment just now, does this mean the police have already identified who they are? Oh, no. The police haven't gotten that far yet. But I have my own conclusions about the true identities of the Phantom Thieves. He's gotta be bluffing. I do. He's, <laughs> He's lying, right? But if it's the truth... You're not going to ask me who they are? It may have repercussions on the investigation. Are you sure you can share that with us? It's only my personal opinion. So announcing that here would pose a I, I think it would. I think that does count as a slander. that everyone present will hear the truth before the police or media. The truth. 
truth. What's he planning on saying? That's quite the confidence you have. And also, like, in, wait, hold on, you can't name us. Very well. We're minors. <laughs> Yeah, I was like, I'm pretty certain that's slander. There's no way he could have any evidence. They're people you all know quite well. Me. <laughs> me and oh, and also me. I apologize for the interruption, but I can't turn off my phone due to my job. Get Pedro. Do you mind if I step away for about ten minutes or so? Yes, after that drama. I will. <laughs> Is there a room I may use? There's the PE faculty office. Sorry about that. I want you to come too. There's a matter I want to discuss. Your friends from yesterday are here, aren't they? Can you bring them too, if that's all right? Did you set this up? We only have ten minutes, you know. Koro, have you a point to prove? What are you going to announce for dating? No. That's got to be shocked. I have video footage too. Please, let's not feign ignorance. All of you can go to that other world too. Yes. It's not just all of you. I am aware of that world yeah, too. Yeah, we did kind of trap you in it. I also know that when you traverse over there, your appearance changes as well. It's because of those mysterious powers, isn't it? I found out about that world about a month ago. This had been installed onto my phone without my knowledge. Was it because we trapped you in the <laughs> space station? Have. When the app activated on its own, the scenery around me suddenly changed. Quite frankly, I still can't believe it myself. But from the look of these photos, all of you seem quite used to it. We've been listening to you blab on for a while now, but cut the delusional... All of you are acting as phantom thieves in the metaverse. I can say so with conviction because I have the same power as you. So you admit it then. Oh my innocent to you. In all honesty, I've been curious about you since the time of the Matarame case. This was the only reason you dated me. <laughs> but to think it would end up like this. We didn't kill anyone! I believe that as well. How can you be so sure? Because I saw another. The real culprit. For real? Who was it? Did they help I you get out? I couldn't identify his face. He had a mask on, after all. Actually, when I took these photos, I entered that world too. That's when I saw someone else moving about, besides all of you. He shot at me the moment he noticed me. That's who killed President Okumura? Most likely. At the very least, I was almost killed by him. I can't die here. I need to determine the truth. When those thoughts overcame me, I awakened to that power. A most fortunate accident. This guy has a persona too? Th this cat. <laughs> I swear, it just nope. talked. Nope, didn't do that. Morgana. Our teammate who taught us about the metaverse. Really? <laughs> this is unbelievable. You can accept the rest of the spies the know things that I don't. Say, Morgana, were you also the one who instructed them on how to change people's hearts? I experienced that world too. But I still haven't solved that mystery yet. We go in the metaverse, or we call them palaces. To steal the core of their desires. Morgana, you are strangely willing to tell him this. And those treasure has been stolen have a change of heart. Ah. <laughs> well, 
There's certainly no way anyone could figure out such an M.O. Anyways, back to what you were talking about. Are we in this mess because of that guy? Although I don't completely understand the method, all you do is simply reform people. Someone else is behind the murders. However, the police have decided that the Phantom Thieves did it. They'll arrest you at this rate. They're going to treat me as my father's murderer? Can you have a phone call? I can't overlook such a grave mistake, which is precisely why I want us to strike a deal. I may be able to save you from this situation. A deal? I would like you to cooperate with me on investigating the truth. And if we decline? Then I think I'll have to inform the police about all of you. Along with that video I mentioned. This ain't no deal, it's blackmail! <laughs> Say what you will. This is the method that I believe is correct. The justice I uphold will not tolerate criminals who kill people at their leisure. Justice. You've heard that Saisan is the one spearheading the investigation about you Phantom Thieves, correct? The higher-ups are concerned only with settling the case. They want to capture the culprits behind the psychotic breakdown incidents and end the commotion. Those are the ones who are putting pressure on Saisan. I can only imagine her impatience. What of evidence that we did it? How do they intend on proving it? Even if there's no objective explanation to the method, it's over once causality is established. Saisan can't make rational judgments at the moment. If she were to be cornered, well, she may even make up a confession. Make it How up? messed up is the Japanese criminal justice so, system? They're gonna make it all our fault just because they feel like it? I know the answer is extremely we messed up. We haven't killed anyone though, and we're still going to be arrested? You'll be found guilty if you're caught, and it will be treated as a very serious crime. Bullshit! None of that makes any sense! Unfortunately, there's nothing I can do alone anymore to stop the flow of things. And that's why you want our cooperation. Yes. In return, I'll turn a blind eye to what you've done. Those are my conditions. That said, I ask that you disband the Phantom Thieves after this. What should we do about Akechi-san's proposal? I see. I don't think it's a bad deal, though. Well, you don't have to decide at the moment. Considering this is you we're talking about, I believe you'll come to a favorable reply. He's calling me out on being shrimp. I'm glad we could talk. It's been a while since I've been able to spend such a meaningful time like this. I look forward to your answer. It was definitely worth coming today, for various reasons. We should be getting back. About that. I'm sorry. Would it be acceptable if we ended the panel here? The reason why you called for me in the first place was because you wanted intel. Correct? My business no, is concluded kind of as well. Skill to I'll deal with it somehow. Damn it! He had complete control over us! Oh no. They're going. I'm sorry about the sudden break. An urgent task came in. So, I truly apologize about this. But I'll have to end things here today. To make up for the time that was planned for this panel, the Rakugo Research Club will instead... Thank you, Rakugo Research Club. I can't say anything in detail regarding the Phantom Thieves' investigation. But I feel another great stride will occur again soon. I hope you all continue to pay attention to what happens. Let's have a big round of applause for today's guest, Goro Akechi. Was that really our best course of action? He totally used Makoto's suggestion against us. Indeed. We intended to get intel out of him, but to think it would play out like this. So what? We'll just accept his deal? He's got evidence on us. We really don't have a choice. Damn it! What are we gonna do? Calm down, Ryuji. 
How am I supposed to calm down? What are we gonna do? What's done is done. We'll have to cool our heads and think more on this. We must make up our minds by the time he contacts us again. We need to give this a lot of thought. Similar occurrences followed in succession earlier this spring. Although things have quieted down until recently, several incidents have occurred once again. Furthermore, new information has come to light about the suspect who suffered sudden mental shutdown. He had received a calling card from the Phantom Thieves. Why did Futaba have something like this? If a calling card was delivered, we can only assume that the Phantom Thieves are behind it. If so, those occurrences back in spring can be attributed to them as well. Moreover... I knew it. She's... Oh, God. Oh, no. She just got out of the show. The post-festival party is about to begin in the gymnasium. Please join us, everybody. Post-festival party? I thought this thing was over. Eh, nobody invited you to it, so let's just go yeah, home. Yeah, let's just go home. Huh? Senpai, aren't you going to the post-festival party? Why would I? Since we've run into each other on our own, why not go together? People say these kinds of events should be enjoyed with others, so let's go have some fun. Don't you have, like, friends? And someone you don't tell about who's your saviour. <laughs> it seems like it's already begun. <clears throat> Let's get in there, senpai! What good is a party if... Goro isn't here? What? <clears throat> well, you see... Oh, we uh, you, you missed it, Peanut. She now has a persona, and somehow that's thanks to me. I don't know how I contributed to that, but she decided I had somehow. Finally, promotion for the dancing games. Please buy them. You've never danced in your life. That forward button show sure looks tempting. the forward button. I must go to Yo, who's that? Huh? Well they all got to go home. Feet, girl. How did the dance club know this? That's crazy. 
this better be important. Oh, Kasumi is loved by everyone. Like we knew because she is a smart jock. I hate this, 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 I hate I could tell. Thank you. Wasn't a compliment. Wow, that dance was amazing. I know, right? I was totally. Blown how away. did how did the dance club know that she'd done Bali? Uh, it's my dad. He's telling me to come home before it gets too late. Damn, must must be so hard. Sorry to leave you like this, but I have to get going. Good. Please excuse me. The post festival party was so much fun, especially with you. See you soon. I just want to emphasize I like most other girls in this game, not counting Makoto. I just want to emphasize that. Like Haru, I love you, Haru. Obviously. How does Dad just die? We can hang out for. Alright, that was a great performance by the dance club. Everybody give them another round of applause. <sighs> I'm sorry. I can't stop thinking about what Akechi-kun said. So right, we're besties now. <laughs> Feels like nothing bad could ever happen when you say that. That's because I'm dating him. <laughs> the student's sharing fest special keeps going. And keeps getting reintroduced. Sharing? I never knew we had such an event. Alright, who has something to say? Anyone? Anyone? No? I'll just have to pick someone then. Oh, He's going to choose? I wonder who it will be. How about that fluffy haired girl over there? I choose you! Huh? Is he... looking this way? Well then, come on up! He's talking to me, isn't he? I can't do that! And your name is? Wait, you're a Kumara son? Um, yes. She's a Kumara son. I'm sure you're, um, still grieving. <laughs> when you realize you may stop.
Not much, bro. <laughs> to tell you the truth, I'm interested in that myself. Oh. Don't worry, Harry. The, this is pure distraction. See to your job. The post festival party is finally over. It turned out to be more like an interview party, huh? I still can't believe you said that. Huh? Right. At any rate, I'm not sure what I would have done without you. Thank you for saving me. You're a mysterious person. But you're so reliable. I think the two of us will get along quite well in the future. Yeah, besties. <laughs> As they say, who knows what may lie ahead. For now, I'm worried about what happened with Akechi-kun. But I have to say, my first post-festival party was quite fun. Though, I guess it's my last too. Here, I'd like you to have this. Oh, thank you. I bought it earlier. <laughs> now then, let's go home. Welcome home. Did you get locked out? You took off somewhere during the festival, huh? I tried to find you, but I gave up pretty quickly. Utaba? What are you doing here in front of the store? Are you I in time out? My brain. My thoughts were getting out of hand. Not just a catchy, but other stuff too. We're in deep trouble unless we can do something soon. But anyway, I was just thinking about going inside, so your timing is perfect. Let's go. The mass media has been causing quite a commotion lately. No countermeasure for the phantom thieves, the sorry state of the police, destruction of safety. They're saying whatever they want. So, how's the investigation progressing? Any clues yet? Nothing that leads to a firm conviction yet. What's going on here? Didn't you say that you were sure about closing this case? And I thought I told you that failure won't be tolerated. <laughs> well, this is troublesome. If things continue at this rate, never mind a promotion. We'd have to let you go entirely. But, sir... I had high expectations for you. But it seems this task was too much to handle for someone so young. We may need to reform the operation as well, since the selected personnel for this... Please, let me see this through to the end. This case is something that right, I've always... Perfect, I know that you've been at this for a while now. Even before the police spared us the staff for it. If you can manage an arrest, I've made special arrangements so that you can question them personally. That's what you want, isn't it? The leadership of this country is about to change. We can't let this case carry over into their term. I'll make myself clear again. Failure isn't an option. We need results. I understand. You're allowed to take some bold measures if you need to. We need good results, no matter what. 
Oh. One more thing. If the unexpected happens to occur, contact me immediately. To you, sir? I said that failure isn't an option, didn't I? Yes. Everything is proceeding as planned. <laughs> Jiro? I was cleaning up and found this. <gasps> this is a calling card, right? I read about it online, too. Y you went into my room without my permission? I'll apologize as much as you want later. So, what is this? That's... Is it something to get flustered over? I knew it. This isn't just some game you're playing. Why aren't you saying anything? Why did you keep it? I mean, it was memorable. Explain. Explain. Can't tell me? Explain. Look what you did. You gave the baby a panic attack. If this keeps up, Futaba's... I'm talking to Futaba here, you I'll get right to the point. Is this a real one? Did they trigger a change of heart in you? <laughs> Look what you How did. Nice. Stop it. Ever since Mom died, I... There was n no exit. Look what you did. I was trapped in, in a labyrinth of my heart. I knew I had to leave it, but I, I couldn't do it by myself. Futaba. Here, sit down. I can at least listen to what you have to say. Damn right you can. The Phantom Thieves saved me. They stole my messed up heart. It's the same as Mom's research. They changed my cognition. <laughs> Seriously? <sighs> Lokaba's research about altering one's cognition. I wondered about it myself, too, but still. When she said she was going to go to the beach out of nowhere, even the doctors had thrown in the towel. <laughs> At first, I just chalked it up as other kids being a better support for you than any adult. But as I kept watching the tabloid shows here, day in and day out, a thought crossed my mind. I thought your case kind of seemed similar to what these phantom thieves were doing. Wow! I'm still your guardian, you know. I'd never overlook such a drastic change in your behavior. So, Jiro. But to think that Wakaba's research and the Phantom Thieves changing hearts were about the same thing. <sighs> Back in the day, I used to be a government official. My job was to be the bridge between the country and the lab that Wakaba worked at. It's around that time that I got to know her. She said something odd when we were out drinking, that one of these days, she might die a bizarre death. Who wouldn't take that as a joke? I just laughed it off. But it happened exactly as she said. If anything were to happen to you, I'd feel like I let her down. There's something I want to ask you. Judging from your attitude, you knew about this calling card, didn't you? You should have known that Futaba had a change of heart through the Phantom Thieves as well. Is there a connection between you and them? The first incident of a change of heart was a teacher at your school. The kid who brought that painting here was a pupil of that artist who had a change of heart, wasn't he? And then, there's Futaba. You always seem to be linked to these incidents somehow. Got anything to say? I have a right to remain silent. So... Can I assume that you admit to it? No, you know I said what nothing. People call them criminals. 
Why did you introduce such dangerous people to Futaba? That's not true! I asked them! That's why he saved me! He stole my heart! Asked? Stole? Uh, um... Wait, are you saying that he's the one who changed your heart? Wait, he doesn't just deal with the Phantom Thieves, he's actually one of them? <laughs> You're pulling my leg, aren't you? Uh. Are you serious? I mean, you knew you were bringing a criminal. You really are a phantom thief? Oh, for crying out loud. So, Jiro. So, basically, I've been sheltering a phantom thief for the last six months. And on top of that, Futaba's involved too. What the hell? I... I want to find the culprit who killed my mom. Wait, it killed? She was killed. I... remember it now. Stop this nonsense! Why won't you believe me? Are you the same as everyone else? Didn't you know already? The way mom died wasn't normal! Didn't you notice that her research was stolen by someone? Sojiro! When she passed away, I did think it was odd. It was awfully fishy. But what could I do? All I was able to do was run from it all. Run away, hide, and end up here as some old guy running a cafe. To be frank, I took you in for my own good. Like it'd somehow make up for what I'd done. It's basically my fault that you got burdened with all this crap. It's not your fault, Sojiro. I acted all big, lectured, even yelled at you kids. And I end up getting consoled by her. God, real pathetic, aren't I? One at fault. <sighs> I see. Don't worry. Even if you are the real Phantom Thieves, I have no intention of reporting or kicking you out. <laughs> I mean, who would believe such a story? <laughs> Unless they catch you red handed, it's impossible to explain that you're the Phantom Thieves. <laughs> Let me just say one thing, though immediately back out of a fight that you can't win. Don't you get it? If by chance you pissed off the same guys that killed Wakaba, then they're not someone that kids like you can deal with. Sorry, can I let my cat Listen to off? Reason, all right? I mean, the cat's out of the bed. Come on. We're done talking about this. Come on. Time to eat. All that yelling's gotten me hungry. If he turned us in, that would have jeopardized our operation. Still, we should tell the others about what just happened. Oh, I'm tired. win no matter what yeah this could have gone a lot worse we still have a house mm. okay, we're not allowed out Futaba is still in my room though. sorry Hey! 
a lot. Okay, I'm being too to go to bed. That concludes the speech given by Representative Masayoshi Shido, who may be forming a new party. We now resume our coverage of the Phantom Thieves. The suspects for Mr. Okumura's death. I just want to do like the afternoon. Police have designated the Phantom Thieves as the country's most wanted fugitives, and have decided to reward anyone with information leading to the capture of the Phantom Thieves. Three thousand. Those who provide information yeah. will be offered a reward of thirty million yen. And considering the high amount, it shows how extraordinary the situation has become. Reward money will be supplied by the police and the families of the victims. Further, I don't know. I might turn us in for that money. The police and they arrest you. I supposedly get thirty million yen for it. I hope you understand the situation <laughs> you're in. Even people who didn't have an interest before will be on the lookout for the phantom thieves, and it'll happen every day, even at school. Why did this happen? This isn't about me. Well, how do I put this? I'm sorry I didn't realize it. It's also my responsibility that this happened. All I can do now is give you shelter. Just don't become desperate and do something reckless, all right? I won't sell you out. As long as you're here, there's nothing to worry about. I feel bad about what we've done to the chief. I'm responsible too. Morgana, it's kind of mostly your fault. Did you see that reward? <laughs> Perhaps we put too much pressure on them. With this, the phantom thieves have become public enemy number one. <laughs> that will be when their curtain falls. Hey, <laughs> great! No, I don't want to talk in person. I want to do social links. Where one and the rewards 30 million yen? What is this, a comic book? <laughs> it feels so unrealistic, I can't help but laugh. We are finally being treated as actual criminals. I'm positive now. Remember all of those what ifs I mentioned before? We haven't done social links in like two weeks. Up. How President Okumura ranked first, the fad before that, even Medjed. It was all to make the Phantom Thieves famous. On top of that, we were lured to target Okumura. Yeah, the enemy likely planned to lay the blame on us from the start, after we gained popularity. Then what about everything we've done until now? Are the people whose hearts we changed and thought were corrupt actually not? No, because of Yusuke and I. The Matarame and Kanashiro cases were coincidental. Wasn't that the case with Kamashita too? Considering what happened with the rankings, only the previous target would have been used to lure us. What a cheap trick to use. Cheap? It's nothing of the sort. There's the fake Medjad and the site's altercation. They might have even engineered the fat around us. So much time and effort has been put into this. President Okumura probably wasn't their only target. Perhaps they intend to place all blame of past and future psychotic breakdowns on our group. That's why I said we shouldn't jump into things so carelessly. What, so this is my fault? Even you agreed to it in the end. And there was that thing with Haru at the time. How are we supposed to ignore that, huh? 
I'm sorry. This was all because I one-sidedly decided that my father was a criminal. All I could think about was my fiancé. If I had only been able to cope with it more calmly... Haru... It's not Haru's fault. I should have spoken up too when Principal Kobayakawa died. Damn it! This is bullshit! God! Fuck! Ryuji! Taking out your frustration on things doesn't help anyone! Hey... What do you think? Why did we lose? What did we do wrong? It's probably because... we weren't acting like ourselves. Agreed. At the time, we only cared about the opinion of the general public. Yeah... that really is it. I was... so caught up in making a name for ourselves. I'm such an idiot! I became a phantom thief because I hated those same kinds of adults! To think we had begun clinging onto fame and a place to belong that our eyes had become clouded. We were meant to be the righteous phantom thieves, but we lost sight of our original cause. I'm so irritated with myself. Makoto... Damn it! I know that we've been set up, and that I was a complete idiot too, but still... It's so damn frustrating! Of course I want to do something about this! Yeah. We'll be in deep water at this rate. However, we have no idea who we're up against. And whether they're an individual or an organization. Furthermore, they must be in a position of power. Or have powerful backers if they can go so far. Are we really a match for this? Should we... end this now? I mean, things might get worse for everyone. Hey, what should we do? Yeah, running away with our tails between our legs is exactly what they want. We'd be dumping everything we stand for just to save our own asses. I mean, our original purpose was kind of just to, you know... Be our old teacher. Not like this. Absolutely not like this. Looks like we're settled on what we want to do. All that's left is how we go about. Yeah, let's bring in Goro. That sounds yeah. great. I'm never getting to do social links, Cotton Tail. Goro. Hey, uh, it's me. Not Goro. Um, about me yelling earlier, being framed, and the added bounty. It all felt like such bullshit. I lost it. I'm sorry. <laughs> you too? It is confusing. We're wanted criminals now. Maybe I haven't changed at all since that time we went up against Kamoshida. I wanted to be a phantom thief because I thought even someone like me could be a hero. It made me so happy to be depended on. Guess it all went straight to my head. I thought I could do anything if it was for justice, but that'd make me no different from our targets. I called them shitbags, but I must be the shittiest of shitbags. I can't even joke about it. <laughs> You're right. I can. Thanks. I feel like I can think straight now. Oh, I scared Haru and Futaba, didn't I? I'll have to apologize to them soon. You can phone them. We're never getting to do a social link. We've reached a crucial moment. There's no point fretting about it now, though. Let's just stay calm and wait for tomorrow. Okay. Let me guess. Yep, still not allowed outside. Oh, you want oh, to do it? I need to check the TV. Yep. Nope. 
Oh, hold on, I actually should uh, stock up on coffees for the next dungeon. Or palace, whatever. Make sure you close up. Why do you dislike right. Goro? Strong famous bar because I dislike her because she's It's basically just because she's a mini cop. And I'm I think I feel like that's enough of a description to say why, but uh I know it's something that probably improves if you go along her social link, but the fact that she feels the need to follow a, follow, uh, you know, other students from her class around to criticise where they have got a job and not, you know, if they have a shady job, question why that shady job exists and not the teenager desperate for money. <laughs> you know, it's that thing of blaming who is actually the victim instead of the actual root of the problem. Which is probably something that I would hope they go into on her social link, but I just don't trust that they would. Because in the end, I have been befriending Sai, who has, who is interrogating me while I'm drugged and beaten in a police interrogation room. Like, I do feel she is the better rote version of Kasumi. Like, she is what Kasumi should be, except for the part where she's a cop. <laughs> well, then. Oh, An issue in which criminals do whatever they want under the name of justice cannot be left alone. Only now does the government speak of taking countermeasures, but their actions are too little, too late. The government as it stands has been left behind the times. It is obsolete. Like, I feel the important part of there is, it is this, like, I don't really hate Makoto, because I can see that there is a chance that they do improve upon her, so I wouldn't go as far as to say I hate her. Unlike, of course, Kazumi, who apparently thinks the sun shines out of the protagonist's arse. And I have no time for that kind of writing with female characters. Because it's just wish fulfillment and it's not good. And, <laughs> and also, you know, it's, her problem in life is she's a smart jock with parents that love her. And... It, even though, like, of course her sister has died, they don't touch on that. <laughs> like, they just kind of bring it up and then it's not as big an issue as, oh, people don't like her because she's a smart jock. Something that no one has ever been bullied for in real life. <laughs> we don't have to go down with a sinking ship. We have the power to change this. Let us end He's a politician of the ruling party, isn't he? I heard they're splitting up to form a new party, so an election might come before the year's end. I'm gonna vote this time Is that how sure. the electoral system works support. in Japan? You haven't voted until now? That's problematic as a member of society, you know. Politics <laughs> just never interested me before. But this politician seems pretty amazing. He's passionate and thinks of the future. I mean, someone like that should be prime minister. I'm definitely voting for him. Well, I suppose that makes sense, since the other politician seems so unreliable. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> that's that's the one reason I can say that I like Makoto more, is Makoto isn't putting, isn't just her senpai, please. When you say that you want us to cooperate with you, what exactly do you intend us to do? And of course we love Goro because he's evil. But might I have a cup of coffee first? <laughs> of course you can, Quit baby. Quit around! Please keep this short. He's mean and I He's like that. for information in addition to the arrest warrant. Those are quite desperate measures. <laughs> Give me I'm a coffee or a turn you in. 
I assume all of you were at your wits' end. I don't have well. enough money to she buy coffee. She must be considerably vexed if she's gone that far. Make headlines with the arrest warrant, then use incentives to get testimonies. It's not a bad method. The police have nothing on us. There's no way they can make an arrest. True. I'm the only one who's ascertained your true identities. However, the groundwork for fabricating testimonies and concocting a culprit are underway. We don't care about that self-gratification. Get on with it. I'll be blunt. I'm thinking of triggering a change of heart in Sai Sun. I've already discovered that she has a palace. Huh? Really? Is this to prevent the investigation agency's recklessness? Precisely. Still, there's no need to change her heart just for that. Indeed. It's hard to believe that a single person can fabricate all that. Unfortunately, that's not the case. What if I told you that those around her would turn a blind eye to false evidence? You saying the police would do such a thing? It seems they're more trusted than I thought. Their priority is settling the situation. They don't care who the supposed culprit is. No! They're completely rotten! My objective is to find the true culprit. That must be the case for all of you, too. However, the current situation is extremely bad. If worse comes to worst, someone unrelated will be set up as the culprit, huh? Our only solution to this is to make Sai-san come to her senses. If she's in her right mind, she can stop this situation. Her sense of justice wouldn't allow it. So that's why... The truth will be covered up. And an innocent civilian's life will be destroyed. I can't allow such a thing to happen. My own ethics won't stand for it. I mean... I guess I can understand how you feel. And changing Sai-san's heart will be to protect her as well. How do you mean? If the true culprit were to learn that she's responsible for the investigation, what would happen? I'm certain they'll aim for her life. She's the perfect target to place blame on the Phantom Thieves. So how about it? Will you agree to my plan? Even though you're particular about being just, you're willing to get your hands dirty? It can't be helped in order to ascertain the truth. There is also one more merit in changing Sai-san's heart. She'll be a fine warning to others not to meddle with you any further. They can't go public if someone in the investigation has a change of heart. It'd show their corruption. All that's left from there is for me to discover the identity of the true culprit. <sighs> what do you mean? You're gonna tell us to announce our disbandment once the real culprit is arrested, aren't you? As expected from Anijima. So, what do you say? I don't think it's a bad deal for either of us. Makoto, what's your take on all this? It's a well-made plan. It even takes putting an end to our team into consideration. I'm flattered to hear that. Why are you willing to do all this, Akechi-kun? Why do you seek justice? Because of sickening human beings. Yes. My contempt for such people drives my sense of justice. It isn't some grand reason like society's sake or some lofty ideal. It's simply an absurd grudge. <laughs> and extremely personal. <laughs> okay, baby. Dude. You know, doesn't he remind you of us? Yeah, think. I can't really explain it. But I guess it's how some disgusting adult pissed him off. We are Do you similar, want therapy? Huh? Maybe that's why I thought that I could ask this of you all. Won't you cooperate with me on the mission to change Sai San's heart? Anything for you, Biff. <laughs> I was actually rather worried there. This mission can't succeed without your cooperation, after all. The Phantom Thieves will be disbanded, and everything will work out. I pray it does. Mako-chan. I'm okay. I never brought it up until now. But the reason I joined the Phantom Thieves is... Because I wanted to change my sister's heart. I was hoping I wouldn't have to resort to it, though. I've also known for quite some time that she has a palace. Why didn't you tell us? 
It was too selfish of a reason. Though I was too scared to look any further into it on my own. Why don't we try going there now to scope the place out? A lot of this will be new to me, so I'd like to get myself accustomed to it too. Girl, have you considered I want a social link? Today. I see. That's unfortunate. Will you tell your sister about this? Of course not. It's just... You seem awfully evasive today. Is something the matter? I just can't make time today. Let's call it a day then, and resume this tomorrow. I'm sorry, everyone. Wasn't Makoto acting a bit weird? Well, I guess that can't be helped. Regardless, it all starts tomorrow. I hope this goes well. Then the Phantom Thieves targeted me as per his advice? Oh, right. And he had already oh. experienced the metaverse by the time of the Okumura case? That can't be. I mean, he never said a word. <laughs> Although, his attitude did change suddenly around that time. Akechi kun kept quiet about the most important details, and my own sister may be a Phantom Thief? If this is all <laughs> true, sound like I was out of the loop the entire time I led the investigation. What a joke. So you became convinced of another's existence through the two mental shutdown cases. And if you were apprehended while falsely accused of those crimes, that villain would still be loose. That's why you targeted me? Not for your own preservation? Hmm? <sighs> no. If this villain does exist and is setting up your group, I would be targeted next. Did Makoto come up with that speculation? Perhaps I'm overthinking things. Hey! You need to keep your focus! It seems you're completely worn out, but the look on your face isn't one of defeat. Why is that? I'm amazed. It seems you can still talk. When you were arrested, a man at the scene told you that you were sold out, correct? Those words normally hint at the existence of a traitor. Yes, However, it was me. I set this entire true, thing up. One reason can be concluded. It's frustrating to admit, but at a certain point... No, most likely from the start. I was a mere puppet. Someone set up only to bear responsibility later. Someone intended your arrest, and the minimal staff directly involved were in their pocket. And if that's the case, true integrity would side with you. What was the point of the Kasumi dancing scene? Alright. No, I'm jumping to conclusions. I don't believe your story yet. There's something I need to confirm with you. Was a change of heart triggered in me? What happened in the time between entering my palace and your arrest? Tell me everything. What's this favor you need? It's late already. We'll be going to Nijima's palace, so I want to look into her. Think those would help us Oops. come up with counter measures in case we hit a roadblock in her palace. I can look up more, you know. Stuff like her repertoire of underwear. Why is that online? A girl shouldn't say things like that. Maybe if she's buying it online. You tell her too. Don't fall for it. Hey, look, if the Tapa wants to look also, up stuff like that, that's on her. It, but my voice... Ow! Same as always. Let me finish first! 
There's something else we want you to look into. Come on. <sighs> I just want to do a stupid social link to get it finished. So this is the courthouse. You can tell it's a revolting building just by looking at it. Let's hurry up and get started. Akechi, what did you find out? I rarely get to see Sai-san directly, but I figured out her course of action. On the 20th, an investigation will likely be done at Shujin Academy, as well as the Sakura residence. For real? Then that means our time limit is November 20th. Still, there will be quite a bit of red tape involved. I doubt it'll take place before the 20th. We'll take your word. For now, we need to focus on infiltrating her palace. I concur. And we should probably get going soon. After all, people like us standing around here is quite unnatural. Well then? <gasps> That's... Huh? What about my smartphone? Oh. Hey! This is the model I wanted! You're so... Goro, can I'm so you buy her a phone? Until recently, Futaba was actually a. Uh, well. It's okay. Sai san told me the gist. Oh, right. Uh, Akechi kun, it may be best if you exchange contact info with everyone, too. Not just me. Uh, me? That's true. He had my number Ooh. first? <sighs> I'll send everyone's contacts to you later. Thanks. <laughs> <coughs> Well then, I hope we get along. I'll do my best. You got a good personality and good looks? Talk about cheating. She's praising you, I believe. Then shall we get started? We need to figure out what Makoto's sis thinks <laughs> We need to use my food. Right? I often hear her call it a place of competition in which she must always win. A competition, huh? That sounds like Sai san. It'd be unbearable if you were put on trial for a reason like that. Although, a competition means it's a match of some sort. Might it be a martial arts ring? Conditions have not been met. Then perhaps a stadium? Or maybe an arena? Conditions have not been met. There are other competitions besides fighting and sports. Gambling, then! How about a racetrack for horses? Other than that, you guys went to Pachinko, gambling quick. Does that count as gambling? Pachinko is gambling. Yes. School trip. What else is there? It must be a casino. Why would it be? <laughs> I definitely you guys see jumped. It. <sighs> well, it's time we head in then. Beginning navigation. Like, that is not anywhere near the top of my list for competition. Oh yeah, us two together. And I guess Morgana. Head right past there and keep a low profile. <laughs> That's it, huh? What's going on here? We are looking at the courthouse, aren't we? Seems like it. Let's <laughs> go. <laughs> right.
courthouse is a casino. Everywhere else seems to be a normal cityscape. Isn't that... The police station, yes. I didn't know that the station and the courthouse were next to each other. Our attire hasn't changed. That must mean we aren't considered threats or hostiles yet. Right. Areas outside her courthouse palace must not be worthy of her attention. Wait, I always look like this. I'm special. Besides, I can't do anything in my cat form. The police station's also part of her work area, though. Whenever arrests are made for her cases. I've brought her food and belongings when she was sent on loan to the police. We got no business with the cops, right? This might be the metaverse, but I don't want to go in a station. That reminds me. He'll need a code name too. Code name? Phantom Thief is going around using the real names, right? It ain't cool either. Mill wife. <laughs> Just for reference, what is everyone else's? Skull. Mine's Fox. And we pretty much decided on them with how we look, didn't we? What is it, Haru? Uh, oh, it's nothing. Then perhaps Karasu will be best for me. You know, like a raven. Are your clothes all black or something? The reverse, actually. If our code names are to hide our identities, wouldn't that be better? Karasu. He'd be the only Japanese sounding one. Why not go with Crow instead? All right. From here on out, <laughs> you don't get a save me a life. <laughs> now then, let's head into the courthouse. Now then. Oh, I mean. <laughs> you know. <laughs> So not finch out. Wait. Oh. Into the garbage we go. Oh yeah, rainbow. Cause we get. <laughs> okay. So, this means we're acknowledged as a threat, correct? Dude, you planning on stealing stuff in that getup? It just means that's what he thinks a rebel looks like. <laughs> no. This is my mental image of a person who sticks to their justice. Okay. <laughs> well, I think your mask is more apt for piercing rather than sticking. <laughs> I'm right. stubby. The people in here look completely normal. But we're in a flashy casino. There's no doubt this is a palace. Oh, right. Crow doesn't know too much about cognitive beings, does he? Ah, yes. In addition to similar topography, cognitive people exist based on the ruler's perceptions. That probably didn't make much sense because all the fancy terms he was using, huh? In essence, since these look like real people, Saison's view of others is surprisingly undistorted. Considering what I see before me, it's difficult to believe it's not actually a real casino. Not all cognitions are normal, though. In Futaba and Okumura's palaces, we had to battle them. People may look normal, but we should be careful. You summoned the Tango Hinge. Positions of power. Is this what you have to go through every time? Hmm. This is a first for me. I'm somewhat nervous. Just don't slow us down, Crow. I will not allow that to happen. Okay, it's time we head inside. Our deadline for this infiltration is November 20th. Any later and we'll get caught in reality. Of course, we'll need to secure an infiltration route before we send out the calling card. As always. So the calling card wasn't nearly yeah, for of course. show? 
It's a necessary step. He bounced. Please stop interrupting. I am interrupt. My apologies. I am well, bounced. Let's go. Oh, do I feel somewhat nervous. Hold on, let us do some important stuff first. After all. Uh, a clip. We can't have him, you know, sticking out. We all wear the same stuff, so it's extremely important. Isn't it? <laughs> Did you move it? We got our chin, we did it. <laughs> I have something. Can you jump from here? No? Barry. I'm not doing the full dungeon because I really, really do need to do uh, social links. And I'm worried if I complete this dungeon, it will, uh, you know, uh, trigger. I was getting arrested. <laughs> trick like that <laughs> it's not a lie I only wish to do this fair and square you aren't going to run are you we should do as she says there is no point in hiding any longer can I get down from here oh, yes I can okay of course so you've come the treasure is located Looking on very the cool. floor at the highest point of this building. Thank you very much. Why are you telling us this? It's as I said before. I wish to go about this in the fairest manner possible. First, I ask that you come up to my location. We will continue this there. I knew you'd say that. Damn it! Over there! It seems we'll be able to use that elevator to reach higher floors. Come, Joker. Let us pursue her. <laughs> Screw the rest of you, I guess. <laughs> Only Let's us. Get after her, Joker. Only us. Us moments. <laughs> Investigate at the minute. I can feel it. Boyfriend that makes you play the game. Where's the door to this thing? Here. 
I wish you could zoom the camera out. Required. Members card? Oh. I can't handle your technical speak. Just... Give me it straight. He can't do that. He's gay. <laughs> Casinos typically have a membership system called a player's club. Some locations even have areas cordoned off for particular ranks of player. So we can't get good at gambling. The setup of this Finally. Place, <laughs> I thought things may be similar here. Finally gambling minigame. That'll make this shit simple. Come on, let's join this player thingy. I would agree with you, but... A shadow! As I expected, registration will not be such a simple matter. She must be daring us to challenge the security of this place to make it to her. Here it comes! Oh, what's... No need to worry. I'll handle this. I need to prove my worth to you, after all. I promise to surpass even such lofty hopes as those. <laughs> well then, let us begin. Look at him in his Kasukiyama uniform. Don't worry, you can leave this one to me. Take them down, Robin Hood! Persona! Hey, you didn't give me a hint out to Don't which move I meant to use. Robin Hood! Never mind, didn't matter. moments finally here give it all you've got oh I will okay anytime so people are turning on us even in his survey our popularity is really at an all-time low. Oh, manger zone. Nope, completely wrong. Featherman. Um, how many how many times can you be betrayed? Hey. Make sure you close up.
okay. Okay, so I might not be able to get therapy today. Let me just check. Oh. Right. So that's all. That's my coral. Okay, we'll go do our first son. I should check the TV. Shopping. All right. Hello, son. Yeah. No way. All right. This is the only way for me to try and kindness in this game. <laughs> Is my wife come by? Clues. 
but he's confident enough to say he can definitely catch the guy. No wonder he's a star detective. Even the way he talks about these things is different from us. There was one I was wanting to do, but I can't remember what it was. So we'll just do this one. should be grateful. Ooh. I don't know. Oh, and flex ailments. Oh, right. so that's how you get ailment stuff. What's the meaning of this? What's up, your cop? so proficient. I think we could have maxed Later. the proficiency out twice by now. Oof. Good morning. My sister is... serious. Her determination to win this fight is reflected in that casino. She won't be easy to beat. I know that better than anyone. I want to understand our situation as soon as possible. Let's go to the palace today. No. Nope. Sorry. Perhaps I am getting a bit too high strung. You are. I can't bear seeing my sister like this. We'll stop her, no matter what. If We're you're doing going by any works. chance, let me know. I'll make sure I'm ready at a moment's notice. You do not get to tell them what to do. We are doing social links. Hey. Hey. We're getting therapy, whether you like it or not. I just want to get these ranks before he goes. Well, 
See you. I didn't catch if that said it will or it won't. <sighs> and then I head back out. God damn it, when will we be able? When, when can we take? Oh, actually, you know something? No, you're not. You're not waiting for anyone. I have an idea. Welcome. What do you play? Yeah, he says any time I need, and yet. What do you want to do? Get in here. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Screw you. Screw you trying to escape friend time. Oh, I didn't invite anyone else. Um. <coughs> <laughs> We didn't, we didn't invite anyone else. <laughs> we usually have like three people here. <laughs> and we're gone. Mm. Yes. 701? <laughs> Alright, show off. Well. I should have saved before this. I love his sweater vest. So cute. All right. Okay, show off, boy. I'll give it a try. <laughs> you truly are a show off. The one offer. I did good. Speaking of which, I'll give it a try. I'm going for the hundred fifty. Sixty, sixty, forty. You're insane. Let us leave it at that then. Do your best. Damn it. Never mm. mind. Yes. Shut up. Hmm. Tabs on. <laughs> what do you think of that? Mm. <laughs> mm. 
Even when I lose, I win. <laughs> I was trying to send him a message and I don't think he got it. <laughs> Probably right. because he's a grandpa. <laughs> I'll give it a try. Do your best. Do you feel like hitting those sixties, Gordo? Speaking of which, I'll give it a try. No, Gordo, you have to hit a sixty, or I can't win. Let us leave it at that then. Do your best. So bad. I'm so sorry, mm. Goro. Mm. He doesn't love me. That was rather exciting. That should do it for now. Goodbye. At least I forced him to hang out with me.
Okay, first therapy. So it's gonna be harder. He sure he doesn't want to give me therapy today. Okay, no therapy allowed. I guess I'll go babysit my son. Okay, I'm just gonna end it there for today then. We're never getting to so the social links we actually want to do a cotton tail. But thank you for joining. I appreciate you all as always. And we'll be back playing more soon enough. I believe tomorrow is Persona 2 day, then the day after we're doing more Persona 5. So I'll see you then. Let's see who we can get a raid on for. Oops. See if anyone's on. Mm. Nope, not really. Oh well then. Right, thank you guys. Bye bye.